But is there anything bad about Friday the 13th? Do you get nervous at all? Not really. I was born on a Friday the 13th. Ah, so it's a good day. <laughs> I feel like I've been very lucky as well, yeah. yeah. Number 13 is my lucky number. And I come from, like, an Irish family, so my mum was very, very superstitious. There were certain things, like, you never put new shoes on a table. Yeah. yeah. Must obviously not walk under a ladder. And if I smash a mirror, because yeah. I'm always plucking my chin and forever it drops off the... <laughs> it drops off the window onto the floor and smashes. I'm traumatised, because I think something really bad's going to happen to what me. What will happen? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> One of my family yeah. or something. Always, always go out like the that. same door as you come in. What? My Sorry, mom can I just say for the smash one. mirror thing, I heard it's seven years bad sex. Is that what oh. it is? Yeah. Maybe I've smashed too oh. many times. <laughs> <laughs> to sex with you, Andrea. <laughs> no, no, that's, that's what I heard, but no, I dropped a, a few mirrors in my time. <laughs> is it still all right? Okay. Yeah. Maybe I just don't know the difference. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know. Anyway, carry on. No, it's my, it, well, actually, the 30th is my brother's birthday today. Oh, oh, happy birthday, yeah, birthday. birthday. So he's born on the 13th as well, so we've had a few Fridays. And, uh, yeah, so it's our lucky number two. We yeah. absolutely... I mean, like, if we're going on an aeroplane, some aeroplanes actually don't have a row 13 anymore, do oh, they? Oh, for goodness sake. No, they don't, but, I mean, I'll always choose row 13, so I'll always be drawn to 13, so I love it today. I don't have trisodecophobia. What? Oh, that's what it's called, fear of the number 13. I don't have chuck, I don't want to wear. I don't have it either. I do <laughs> It's called what is trisodecophobia. It? trisodecophobia. It sounds like that thing where your hair falls out. Is that a phobia <laughs> against 13? Yeah, 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 it is. Against the number 13. There yeah. are enough <laughs> scary things going on in the world already without us adding 13 to the list. <laughs> I just can't go. Don't you do something strange that if you see a, a hearse go by? If I see or... a hearse go by with a coffin in, I have to hold my collar until I see a four-legged animal. And sometimes it can be really <laughs> difficult, especially when I'm driving, so I'll have, like, one hand on the wheel. <laughs> The kids are in the back and they can put your hand back on the wheel. I can't because something bad's going to happen to one of you. Oh, so I have to do it and I have to drive around until I see a four-legged oh, animal. What if you saw? What if you saw a coffin with a magpie on top of it? Oh, Can you like that? Nice. <laughs> 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 your hands. That would not work because it's only got two legs. <laughs> it's got to be a four-legged no, animal. You've got to salute and hold your collar. Oh my God! Then, we, then we're in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> and then how do you touch wood? Touch wood. Touch wood. Touch wood. Go hold your collar. Under a ladder. 